previous episode of Life is Strange. Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! He called film Whoa. little pieces what of time. What the fuck? But he could be talking about photography. Or have you done something wrong? Talk to me. Hey, Victoria. What do you want, Max? I see everything here at Blackwell. Do you understand what I'm saying? No, and leave me alone. For reals, Warren, this is between you and me. Don't insult me. Max, go on. Hey, leave him alone. Max? Chloe? It makes perfect sense I'd see you today. Welcome home, Max. That's Rachel Amber. Her missing person posters are all over Blackwell. Six months ago, she just left Arcadia. Without a word. Without me. Something happened to her. Wait! Is that grass? Tell me the truth. That's an order. I didn't black out. I had another vision. The town is going to get wiped out by a tornado. Max, tell me everything. All right, so hopefully my choices from episode one actually actually saved because it said that I still had done those when I checked it, so. All right, we're, uh, we're waking up in the morning. Oh my God, I hate my alarms. Like I've been setting alarms recently. All right, so beginning of episode two, guys, part seven. Let's, uh, I, I don't really remember exactly how it starts. I played it the other day, but I don't remember exactly how it starts. That's how forgetful I am. Yay. Oh, my God. It's cringe. I know one time I played this and uh, I started in episode two and it was it was very glitchy. I don't know if you guys have seen that video or not, but it, it, it was very glitchy. But uh, I think Life is Strange has to be one of my favorite games ever. Like. Literally, I could just play it over and over and it's just like it never gets like nothing is bad about it There are some things I don't like about it, but All right, let me turn off I need to shower. Let me turn off the radio. I don't want anybody hearing my music Use this Warren is blowing up my inbox now uh, As long as he helps me figure this out Hey Max, the doctor is in the house. Oh my god. I've been thinking long and hard about your weird request. I just sent you a bunch of physics and science links and without further ado, here's a few time travel films you must see. Blah blah blah, doctor expects a full... Is he making a... I, I don't know. The Time Machine, Primer, Time After Time, Pulp Fiction, which is actually, <laughs> I have not seen Pulp Fiction yet. Please don't hurt me for that. Somewhere in time, big cult around the romantic, I'm not going to read all this. Time Cop. I have seen Time Cop before, I think. That's all the time I have now as I do have actual quantum physics to plow through and not your fun back to the future homework that I never get. Now that you've discovered the art of science, I expect to see you in the lab more as well. I could always use a m new partner in time. Get it? Don't hit. I'm leaving. Doctor Who? <laughs> Is he really calling himself Doctor Who? Got a bail master, uh... Okay, my, my choices do matter. Because, okay. Because I actually did take the fall for, uh, um, it's Chloe. It's so cool having Chloe back in my life again. Like no time has passed. 
So I'm looking for um, Warren because he actually stalks you. I don't know if he's in there or not. Drink up. Oh no, 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 no! Wait a minute! Wait a minute! I'm gonna drown her. No! Don't do that, Max. No. No, no, that is the wrong thing to do. Okay, I've already fed her, or watered her. Good morning, Lisa. Your leaves are lovely today. Why did I say I don't have a green thumb, but I have a green finger. No smiling. Take your power seriously. Ah, uh, perfect. I want to be a photographer. Oh. Hello, zombie face. This is what happens when you research quantum physics all night. Yeah, you you really shouldn't do that, you know, Max. I do not forget I need those papers before tonight, like now. Thanks, Sherry. Yeah, of course, Victoria. I'll get the tests and papers to you this afternoon. I'm so on it. Oh, I'll get the papers to you, Victoria. I promise. Okay, just. Ow! The fuck? Oh my god, huh? Alyssa, can you stand over there? Um, okay, Max, if that makes you happy. No, 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 no. Oh god, what? Wow, <laughs> now that was close. Thank you, Max. Forgot her name. I forgot, um, that's Alyssa. But the one that was like walking with the books, I forgot her name. Let me talk to Why, you. Hello again, Alyssa. Okay, Max. That's twice you've saved me from a projectile weapon. Are you Proje oh, okay. Hardly. I just have a sixth sense for trouble. I'm glad to help you out. Blackwell has a surplus of assholes. Oh, by the way, Warren said you borrowed his epic film flash drive. I didn't know you were a sci-fi geek like us. What's your favorite? Back to the future, obviously. In the 1980s. We'd suffocate from all the hairspray. You and Warren do know your sci-fi. <sighs> Careful, you might make Brooke jealous. I'll just pretend I have no idea what you mean. Oops. Brooke, Vortex Club are such just to let you know, I, I, I am a lesbian. Like <laughs> Why did I even say that? Oh my god. You know what? I don't care. I'm all about that Chloe booty. Oh yeah, girl. Oh yeah, we having a dance party. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, I love dancing. Okay, let me talk to her. You're such a free spirit. Hi, Dana. How are you? Much better than yesterday. <sighs> I'm glad we talked. I am too. Me too. I know it's good to just talk about this stuff you're almost psychic i felt like you knew everything anyway by the way the best and biggest news of the day is that trevor asked me to the halloween shindig That's oh my awesome. god so cute uh. we're showing our faces together in public so you absolutely should go with us borrow one of my outfits and come as a cute geek couple with your bitch warm uh, i'm not big on cosplay don't let life pass you by max um so are you coming to the party or not? Uh, maybe not with Warren, but sure. Why the fuck not? If I hate it, I can always go back to my room. That's the spirit, Max. After this, you'll be ready for a raid. It does sound like fun. <laughs> I don't have to go contemplate my party future. But not with Warren, because I am not into him. Hey, Kate. Hey, girl, how you doing? Here. That was. Thanks again for standing up for me yesterday. I'm just gonna mute my mic really quick. Anytime. That guy has issues. Doesn't everybody here? By the way, Max, do you still have my copy of the October Country? Oh yes, of course. It's great so far. I didn't realize Bradbury was such a poet. Can you please bring it back to my room this morning? I just need to take some notes for class. Absolutely. I'll bring it by later.
Oh god. Oh, okay. We're taking a shower. I love the art style of this game. Like, it's it's not... It's just different, you know? It's like not... It's not, like, hyper-realistic like most games. What's up, Kate? Oh, fuck me. That's it? That video of you clubbing didn't look like homework. What the hell, Victoria? Oh my god, right. Don't be shy. I think it's awesome you set a tongue record on video. Bitch. <laughs> you're going to be sorry someday. Oh, boo-hoo. I'm sorry you're a viral slut. I'm sure she had fun. Looks like it. <sighs> you know can hook her up. And you know he has the good shit. Preach it, sister. Oh, preach it, sister. Uh. I got him paint all over my face. Good thing my faithful minions took their sweet time bringing me a towel. We were all the way. Give it a rest, Taylor. Now I know if I'm in an accident, I won't rely on you or Courtney for help. You can hang out with Kate. You sure that's paint? Because I'm pretty sure there's some other white stuff that might be on your face one day. Oh! Okay. Oh, man. She's a weirdo with that dumb camera. Oh fuck you, bitch! You don't even know anything about me. I grew up in the hood. Oh my god. Anyway, I can't even say stuff like that anymore. Everybody gets a chance to see her in action. You are such an evil biatch. I love it. I grew up on Grove Street. Okay, you don't fuck with me. You don't fuck with Max Caulfield, bitch. You don't know me. I'll take a picture of you while you're, while you're um. Hmm, what's embarrassing? While you're eating a cracker. Yeah. Then we'll see who's the viral slut, okay? Fucking bitch. I read Fucking bitch. Wait, well, no, she wasn't talking about me, but still. Even if I can stop one person from watching it, it's worth it. Huh. <sighs> Ooh, a tampon dispenser. I'm good to flow. Thanks. Oh Jesus. Oh, so there's like other people taking a shower. I wouldn't feel comfortable taking a shower in a place like that. She is not. People are so mean. Oh my god. Why are people so mean? Look at me. I am Max Selfie. Oh, hell no. Surveillance cam on. Two can play at this game, Moriarty. They might not believe it, but they won't be sure. Hella yeah. Okay, first hella of the freaking freckle fruck of a part seven. I don't know. Oh. No fucking way. Okay. This is not why I came to Blackwell, and I still have to clean all this crap up after I find Kate's book. Man, this could almost be art if it wasn't so fucking sick and disturbed. Put that right there and... Oh shit. Nathan's revenge. Even Chloe told me not to go to the principal. Well, I didn't know, okay? Alright, let's go, uh... Let's go to Kate's room. Now I can finally take this back to Kate before I'm late. As if I have to worry about being late anymore. I do have all the time in the world now. I, I know I got a text just now, but... I sure would like to catch this hall tagger. Kate? You in there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm in there. Dun, dun. Uh, you okay there? You, you okay? Uh, hey Kate, I brought your book. Max, why did you step in between David and me yesterday? Cause he's an asshole. 
I hate bullies. Yeah. I hate bullies. David Madsen should know better. I was hoping he would. But it's nice to see that you care about me. Kate, I actually do care. So, what's the story with you and David? Well, he's a total paranoid ass. He thinks I'm part of the Vortex Club. Yeah. yeah. Did you party with them? Because that's what Victoria and all these other women, girls, colleagues say. I went to a Vortex Club party against my better judgment. Not my scene at all. Against you know your better judgment? Is this for me? I know this sucks, Kate, but tell me about the video and maybe I can help. Basically, I went to one Vortex Club party and ended up making out with a bunch of people. And I have no memory of it. What the fuck? Yeah, that doesn't sound like you, because like you're 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 the nice, quiet church girl, and I doubt that you would actually do that. You know? It doesn't sound like you. I can't see you partying with Victoria. I didn't. You have to tell me more than that. What happened at the party? Did you drink? I swear to God, I had one sip of red wine, and then I drank water. Yeah, eh. Not enough to get wasted, is it? I don't get wasted. Ever. I take a sip at church and I don't end up on a viral video. Okay? Oh, for fuck's sake. Did somebody drug you? I remember... I remember getting sick and dizzy. Go on. Then Nathan Prescott said he would take me to the hospital. Oh, that punk. Ooh, I hate him. Nathan Prescott? Oh, shit. He was being nice for a change when he offered to help me. He's the opposite of nice. What next? All I recall is driving for a long time. And I woke up in a room. I thought it was a hospital because it was so white and bright. Go on. I'm listening. Somebody was talking to me in a soft voice. I thought it was a doctor until Ugh. I heard Nathan and felt a sharp sting in my neck. And, and, are you sure? Of course. You think I'm making this crap up. No, but I don't, I don't no, think you're I'm making it up. Being Jesus Christ. As usual. Then what happened? That's all I remember. I don't know what happened. I woke up outside my dorm room the next day. I didn't have any marks or bruises. But I felt gross. So, I took the video of you at the party. I have no idea. Probably Victoria. She was there being her mean self. Jesus. <sighs> I'm sorry. This is serious shit. How do I get a viral video taken down? I know it's already spreading. What if my church sees that? I need to know what to do. Kate, uh. we'll figure it out. I'll check back later, okay? Oh my Thanks. god, this is some... I can put my book here near my bag. Ah, uh, this is some fucked up shit. Poor Kate, man. Let's look around her, uh... Let's at least take a photo for Bunny. Oh, look at the little bunny. The little bunny, the little bunny, okay. Poor Kate, man. She has sisters. Uh, um, okay. Sister, mother, father, and Kate. She has her Bible. Kate even makes notes in her Bible. My parents never once took me to church. I had nothing to rebel against. I don't know what to believe now. When justice is done, it brings joy to the righteous, but terror to the evil. Come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Huh. We'll just leave our book there then. So, Max, can I ask you a question? And please be honest. Absolutely, Kate. Anything. Uh. Okay. I need 
need to find out if Nathan Prescott helped me or hurt me after that party. Okay. Should I go to the police? Oh my god. Ah, uh, I did this the other day. And I actually started crying. Because if you go to the police, they're corrupt. They're on the Prescott's payroll. <sighs> we need to look for proof, but she's going to be mad at me. <clears throat> Fuck it. If you do that, they won't believe you. You're on video grabbing at all those guys, and they'll use that against you. Bad. But I know I was up. And that's what you have to prove, not them. I'm just telling you how the cops in school will look at this. The video doesn't exactly back you up. You make me feel so hopeless. No, no, Kate. I just don't want you to get hurt anymore. That seems impossible at this point. So that's your answer? I, I think we should wait. There are other things going on that might help you. But not right now. So I can walk down the halls with people calling me a viral slut. Thanks, Max. Well, I'm sorry, Kate, but that's exactly what you gotta do. You gotta look for proof of this Good bullshit. Job, Dr. Max. She didn't like what I had to say, but we need more proof of what happened. Yeah, we really do, okay? I don't care if she's upset about it. We need to find proof. <sighs> okay, um... I think I'm gonna end it there, guys. Hang on. <laughs> Don't hurt your fingers texting yay breakfast. No. <laughs> oh my god. Let me look at this one really quick. Keep your smart mouth shut about everything or I'm coming for your ass and you you sleep. I said that so calmly. <laughs> hey, honey. I hope you didn't forget to water the plant we gave you. But don't drown it either, mommy. Oh shit. Now I'm getting anonymous threats? It never ends. This has to be from Nathan. But it could be anybody. I better be doubly careful around here or I could be in serious danger. If I'm not already. Hey guys, so I know this one was pretty long. But the only reason for that is because I didn't really feel like editing it down into several parts so I'm going to start making the videos longer and that way I can just get more into the video instead of just cutting them and like uploading them constantly so thank you guys for watching uh, I hope you guys enjoy it so far I'm, I'm sorry that there was a delay between uploads but thank you again for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one